Elsewhere tonight, the Sioux City Human Rights Commission is again working to inform the public about the signs of human trafficking. They say that it's unfortunately going on in our own communities. The commission, along with the Siouxland Coalition Against Human Trafficking, hosting an event this evening titled Human Trafficking in Siouxland. It was tonight at the Public Museum. Bernadette Rixner with the Siouxland Coalition Against Human Trafficking says that there are ways to identify trafficked people and ways that the community can help. Meanwhile, Karen Mackey from the local Human Rights Commission tells us that it is important to talk publicly about the issue because of the difficulty of quantifying the number of people involved. There is more trafficking than you would suspect. You know, we like data, but <clears throat> what we need to remember is behind every data point, that's a human being. And so it really doesn't matter the numbers, um, just that it is an issue in our community, and we all need to be aware of it. Members from the Sioux City Police Department, Lila May's House, Safe Place, and other nonprofits all coming together this evening as panel guests and sharing their efforts to help combat human trafficking happening right here in Siouxland.